just looking at the um, stats again for that um, clickbait blog. Um, 915 views, 375 more than normal, than usual. Um, and watch time was 19.2 more than usual. Four subscribers. Um, <laughs> the mad thing is it's probably going to earn me quite a bit of money and it's just a mundane vlog. That was a fascinating experiment. Well, for me, maybe not for you. Um, during my hours laying in bed, being insomniac last night, I had various things running through my head. I wish I could turn my head off. It will not turn off at the moment. <clears throat> I was thinking about how, how all of the stuff that we do to try and um, get it right, try and... Um, get things just so, try and be perfect. Um, all of that superficial stuff that we do that isn't going to change anything, isn't going to change, isn't going to stop, <clears throat> isn't going to stop the planet heating up, isn't going to stop people going hungry, isn't going to stop people um, being abused, isn't going to stop um, crime it's not going to stop any of that and we can keep slapping the superficial stuff on we can keep working at making our house just so and um wearing um the just so clothes and um wearing the you know the just so makeup and getting our hair just so we can do all of that but it ain't going to change the important things it's not going to make that much difference it it maybe it helps us feel better about feeling better about ourselves will help us feel better about what's going on but actually it ain't going to change that <clears throat> and we can't avoid it the planet's getting hotter it's it's just in it's just incredible the you know the weather is changing so much in so many areas and um, wildfires. There was a wildfire that I haven't looked actually, but a couple of days ago there was a <clears throat> a wildfire down in um, southeast, south, south, southern France, um, very um, somewhere we know because we used um, when we've been down to Collier. There's a, a supermarket we go to the Intermarché at um, Saint Saint Andre, and that's where the fire was. I don't know how that went. I haven't looked since. Um, we're now into canicule, a canicule week, which is heat wave. Um, and the um, criteria for canicule is that the heat, the heat of the day doesn't really dissipate much overnight. Um, so you don't get much of a chance to cool down. And last night um, was quite warm. I think we managed it okay. Um, at the moment it's midday and it's already 30 outside i've got these shutters next to me um partially closed and um, there's just a bit of a gap to allow the light in and we've got the front door shutters closed and um, it's yeah it's 28.9 on the back door which is now out of the sun but when i went to let the chickens out quite late because because i'd been awake so much in the night i was quite late getting up and I went to let them out at 10.30. It felt really hot and oppressive already. It's, um, I just, what have I described it? Um, I described it to someone. I can't remember what I saw. It doesn't really matter. Um, but it, yeah, already really not very comfortable for me. Some people might like it. I don't know. Um, but the whole of next week is going to be really hot. He's got his um, appointment on Monday. And I think it's going to be, um, I think it's going to be 35. 36 and we wouldn't go out in that weather um tomorrow is going to be 30 it's going to be 33 today tomorrow is going to be 34 um <clears throat> monday's going to be 36 tuesday's going to be um 37 wednesday's going to be 37 and then it's going to gradually cool off a bit oh that's ridiculous so the nighttime temperatures um, monday will be 21 tuesday 23 Wednesday 22 and after the weekend the following weekend the weekend my sister gets to us 
will be cooler temperatures and cooler evening temperatures. Thank God, I hate this, I really hate it. And it, as I've said before, I think recently, I, it wasn't on my list when we thought about coming to France. It didn't occur to me, it just didn't occur to me. There's a couple who um, I know through Facebook who were doing a pilgrimage on, I think it's called the Via, Via Franca. They've got to find their update now. And um, they had to um, stop. The, they had to stop um, last year um, because of a foot injury. The Via Franchi Gena, Gena, Francigena. It's a pilgrimage trail to Rome. <clears throat> and they they had to pull out last year due, due to a, an injury, and they started again. Um, this year, about 10 days ago, um, and um, they were in my head last night, laying in bed awake at 2 and 3 and 4 in the morning, and I was thinking, why did they come in August? What? I don't understand why people <clears throat> will choose to do something like that in August, but they've actually just gone home. Um, another problem with a swollen foot and... Um, and I'm, I'm so pleased they've gone home. I mean, they can come back and start again. Um, they've enjoyed their time and, and whatever, and they can come back and start again. And I, and I commented and said, you know, please that you've gone back and um, hopefully that you can choose to come back and do this again at another time in another month. Avoid August. It's like August is stinking hot here. It's not a time that I would choose to travel here. Having said that, um, that's what I know now as a, an inhabitant um, I know that we were here as a tourist in August many years ago <clears throat> I don't remember how hot it was then I don't, yeah I don't remember it being a problem but it certainly is for me now you know the the garden is just dying um, we're not allowed to water we've had drought um, conditions and um, um, when yeah drought conditions for months and we're not allowed to do this we're not allowed to do that I don't actually think I'm allowed to put the hose pipe on after eight o'clock in the evening now and I haven't been because I hate hate wasting water on the garden I just think it is such a waste and I've said it before it's such a waste to be watering a garden when people haven't got water to drink it's just arrogant and that makes me sound really grandiose but I just think it is so arrogant to be chucking water around when people haven't got drinking water <clears throat> so I do try to be a bit careful and um, but I think what we need to do we do need to if we have the energy this evening is to start filling watering cans from the water butts and do a bit of watering in places. I've got dead plants in pots and, and they need watering. Um, and I've been less vigilant. I was really good. And then as I've become less able, um, I've been less vigilant and stopped filling up bowls and filling up watering cans as I did. The first year we, we implemented water savings. I feel a bit bad now talking about it. So I might go back to that. Yeah, I don't know whether we can even use the hose pipe, which of course is easier. Um, but I'm I'm not prepared to do that. So yeah, I've been thinking about how superficial we can all get, and how we can worry about and um, fuss around the things that really, really aren't important, and how it might be useful to use the energy to. Um, throw some of that energy at the important stuff and I, you'll have to tell me what that important stuff is I know what I do and I've just said about water and things like that I know what I do um, to try not to impact on the planet quite so much um, but yeah perfection is only in your mind 
then on that note <clears throat> i'm going to finish my coffee and going to have some toast we're having toast for lunch and i'm doing um i may have mentioned it that um sticky chili beef that you get in a chinese i'm going to do that tonight or this evening um i bought my red chilies in grand Fray yesterday i keep calling it hello fresh in grand Fray. and um they didn't have that many actually having gone all the way over there it's quite a, a stretch in the car for us um so yeah i got my red chilies so i've got all of my ingredients and i just thought because i was up late i don't want to be cooking it now so i'm going to cook it this evening gives me time to cook the rice for special fried rice because you need to cook the rice and then that needs to be cold very cold before you use it in a wok so that's the plan have a nice day <clears throat> it's thursday it feels like friday or saturday because of the bank holiday on tuesday it's got really we get confused about the days anyway um but yeah it's thursday and um and we'll be till midnight bye